Hello, all you glorious people of the world. Chelsea Chi here, back with Paper Mario, the Redux version. Um, I'm sorry I've been away for a while again. Um, I'm finally over being sick, and so I've got my energy back now, enough to um, sit through these long recordings because I'm gonna have to be doing a lot of editing to do our final things that we need to do before seeing Bowser. Um, first thing on our list was finding all the rest of the letters, and that's the reason why I'm at Dry Dry Outpost right now. Um, there is a few that I have missed via the desert. Um, I was gonna actually start in the desert, but then I saw Chuck Quizmo over here, so I figured I'd talk to him, because we do need to do all of Chuck Quizmo's things. That's probably not gonna happen until the next, um, video. But we'll, when we find him, if we come across him, we will do his, uh, quizzes. And hopefully I'm going to edit out, um, any coughs I have. That's really the only thing I have left. How many buildings are there in Koopa Village? There are six buildings in Koopa Village. Uh, back to the wrong thing, this thing. Alright. Let's see. Because we do need those star pieces for... Uh, the final badges. Uh, we've answered 12 questions. Good for us. Okay. Uh, Alright. Um, there should be a letter in this tree. Yeah. To Morty in Koopa Village. So, the one toad that's probably there. Uh... There's a few more. Um, I have that one already. Uh, okay. And now time for us to zoometh our way through the desert. Okay. Pretty sure it's here. Apparently if you hit this tree, there's also a letter in it. You have to wait until Colorado and his camp leaves in order for you to get this one. Which is probably why I've never have. Uh, to Goompa in Goomba Village. Okay. And that one... Uh... I feel like there's a couple on the Mount Lava Lava Island. Um, yeah. Because I gave that one to him. Uh... So I'm pretty sure just one, two. So just two that I've missed. And one of them is like really like finicky. Like I don't know how anybody would have found this letter. Um, I guess you would have had to do the fortune tell thing in order to find it. Uh, but we're going to go um, not to that one that I was talking about. Um, but there is one in flower field that I'm pretty sure I just ran right on by and didn't see. So we will be going there. I'm pretty sure it's this way. Yes. Because we gotta do this. Um... Eh. Thank you. Okay, um, Lord. I'm, thank you. My buttons are not working. I think I remember the pattern. My god, my A button it is not working. This is not very good for when I will have to do action commands. Well, I was trying to go past these guys, but I do need to level up. Uh, I just wish I had someone else besides Lack of Star out. <sighs> Is the thing, but I guess we'll keep him out because it's too much effort to change partners. <laughs> Can 
we would, uh, I actually don't know if we're gonna level up. We haven't gotten any star points, so <laughs> these sort of battles might actually be pointless, but running is also not really an option because I, well, I actually don't think I need coins. <laughs> Because I bought all the badges, I would only need coins really to buy items. So I guess I could take that badge off. And that would give me some more BP because I don't really need extra coins when I get damaged now. Bon and then no one star point! Yeah, the only thing that gave me star points was the um, magic Koopa. Okay, so there is a ha. I missed this letter right here to Minty in Toad Town. We're gonna go ahead and give that to her because she is just right outside of the flower gates. And now you'll be gone, Lakastar. All right, hey, guess what? I did come to visit after all. Goodbye. <laughs> Didn't even talk to him or nothing. Came in, grabbed something I forgot, and then left. It's perfect. There you go. She didn't even talk to us. <laughs> We're just like, here's a letter for you. To me, who's it from? The wise Wisterwood? Who's wise Wisterwood? Thank you for making the flowers bloom so beautifully. Oh, it's a thank you note. It says, please drop by flower field sometime. Wow, how delightful. But how does wise Wisterwood know about me? Oh, excuse me. I'm rambling. This is a small gift to say thank you for delivering the letter. Please take it. And of course it's a star piece. Thank you. The last star piece is back in the cold. Oh, right. <laughs> Gotta... I need money for him. That's what I need money for. <laughs> to buy those star pieces off of him. On top of the rest of the junk I'm probably going to get. Because other than star pieces, he really doesn't have that good of items. He has some good ones. But not all of them. Okay. Now... This is going to be the one that I have no idea how you would even think about getting the letter. I guess we're going to be attacking with Paracarry because I'm probably going to run into these. Yep. <laughs> I didn't mean to get licked, but I had a feeling that we would run into these guys. Alright, Paracarry. At least everyone is double powered up. So it should make for fast battles. And I think we might even level up. <laughs> I'm gonna get two star points. Just enough to level up. Star points. I'm pretty sure we need to level up BP. Because, yeah, if I level up BP, then everything will have two more levels to go. Because HP and FP are going to cap out at 50, and BP is going to cap out at 30. I'm pretty sure. I'm super sure. Um, 
Uh, oh yeah, I just level up. Uh, duh. That's why I'm like, let's go ahead and use that now. I'm surprised I got past that guy. Tried to do that the first time and it didn't work. Okay, so... May hmm. I don't know if you would know. So apparently, if I hammer this tree... I'm like taking off layers of the tree. And there's a letter. How are you how are you supposed to know this? Mayor Penguin has never gotten this letter before, just like Goompa has probably never gotten his letter. So this is going to be new information for all of us. Uh Right. I don't have very much. Um let's use this. Uh, so that's gonna be interesting. Because all the other letters I'm pretty sure I've gotten before. Um, attacking all enemies. Is that really worth it? No, it's not. <laughs> Maybe it was. Because <laughs> I'm a freaking idiot. <laughs> button sticky. Did something- did something get on my controller? Uh... What is- do I even need to do this? Do I even need to worry about this? We're gonna use this. <laughs> Just cause I don't want to go through another round. <laughs> it only did six. Fun in the nut! Three star points! I haven't even gotten to number two on my list! I'm still at one! <laughs> Collecting all the letters! Alright, let's go give this to Mayor Penguin. Okay, so here's what he'll pop up here. I need those star points. I not star I need star points too, but I need those star pieces. Of the following, who is not a member of the Koopa Bros? I'm pretty sure it's the blue. There's not a blue ninja Koopa. There's red, black, green, and yellow. There we go. Thirteen. We've answered 13 questions. Mr. Mayor, I didn't think I'd ever have to come back and visit you, but I guess I do. Uh, I really don't care. I just care about giving you this letter. Take it. Take it and read it. For me? Oh, it's from Yoshi Village. I don't know where that is, but I bet it's pretty far away. I'll read this letter. Thanks very much. Oh, hang on. I'll give you this. So you go through all that trouble and we don't even get to know what the letter says. You know, how dare you? I'm glad I've never gotten this letter before in my life. Not even worth it. Alright. Let's go to Goomba Village and then Koopa Village. Because we gotta end off in Koopa Village. Because our second thing on our to-do list is to talk to old man Koopa Coot. Alright. Goompa is in here because Goompa Pa is the dad. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I've never given you this letter either. What does it say? 
Now, what could this be? Koopa Coot? Eh, I have a bad feeling about this, so I'll read it later. It's probably the old Coot's usual backstabbing gossip. He really needs to get out more. What's the point of sending all these gossipy letters, huh? I know you're pretty busy, so thanks for delivering this. Why don't you take this as a token of my thanks? Harpies. Okay, at least, even if he didn't read that one, at least we kind of got the gist of it. Apparently, old man Koopy Coot likes to stir up some trouble, it seems. Well, I guess he's old with really nothing better to do, so I guess it makes sense. Making sure there's no Chuckquizmo. The only toad that lives in this town. Morty. Alright. A letter? For me? Oh, it's from my wife! How sweet. I love her so. Phew. Oh, pardon me. I got really wrapped up there. That wife of mine. She's so cute. She makes me crazy. Thanks for bringing me joy. Here, take this, okay? Woohoo! Star piece. So that's all the letters done. We can put a big old check mark on that. <laughs> um, the next thing to do is to go over here in this house and do all of Mr. Koopy Coot has some favors he would like for us to do. Uh, so we're gonna do those. Do, 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 do. Or at least do some of them. I don't think we'll do all of them. How many are there? I think there's like 20 or so? Um, there's 20. So we'll do 10. And I think that'll be a good stopping point, um, because after editing, I'm not sure how long this video will be, so we'll do ten. Um, what am I looking for? Nothing that seems to be open anymore, apparently. Apparently I cl closed it and didn't mean to close it. I had my list of, of stuff I needed to do. How rude. Okay. Um, after Koopy Coot, um, I'm pretty sure it was the badges. Finish up the badges. But we'll worry- that, that's for the next episode anyway, so we don't really need to worry about that. Oh lord. Do I feel like reading this? No. But we will do you a favor. I guess the younger generation isn't so bad after all. Borrow the book Koopa Legends from Colorado. Okay. So here's one. Hey there. Your husband did come home. <laughs> uh, yes, I do need something. <laughs> A bit short tempered. I know I'm typically known for like reading all of the text, so I'm sorry that I'm not reading. I probably should read their text. Um, behind the bookshelf. Firmer shells in 30 days. <laughs> but maybe in the next video I'll read them. It's just I really don't feel like doing his voice. <laughs> Let's see. What is he gonna give us? We got one coin. Excellent. Alright. Uh, second thing. 
a sleepy sheep. All right, so we gotta go to Toad Town to get ourselves, I thought, I thought he was down here, to get ourselves a sleeper sheep. You know, I was just thinking, as I saw Chuck Quizmo, that I should have said something while I was buying the sleepy sheep, but I just kind of went through and bought it <laughs> without saying anything. Just like quietly doing the task and I'm like, oh wait, probably should say something. Well, we got the sleepy sheep. Um, how many coins are needed to buy a mushroom at the shop in Koopa Village? Uh, I need four coins to buy a cheap, cheap mushroom. Get ourselves another star piece. Oh, wrong thing. Thank you. All right. And away we go. And away we go as well. Back to Koopy Coot with that sleepy sheep. All right, Koopy Coot. Here's your sleepy sheep. I'm a hero. <laughs> Finally, some peace and quiet. Let's see. Are you gonna give me another coin? Uh, yes, you are. One coin. Uh, there's a playroom in Toad Town. So, a long, long time. Mm, have we? Did I? Maybe? Uh, I know where the pipe is. I don't remember if I activated it. But he's given us the silver credit to go to the playroom, which we might check it out. I don't typically go to the playroom, but I mean, we're doing a lot of things I've never done before, so I might as well go to it. <laughs> Let's see. Um, and find Goompa. He has a tape. If you say the tape. <laughs> um, what kind of tape does he have, Koopy Coot? You know, I'm kind of, it's kind of suspicious, not gonna lie. First you send Goompa some juicy gossip, and now he has the tape. Yes, yes, I'm keeping up the good work. Uh, he wants the tape back. Apparently, Goompa has had it for quite a while. And he keeps it behind the chair. Gotta hide it. <laughs> Alright, the tape! An old cassette tape. Do you want to know what's on the tape? <laughs> it was great though. You know, Mario is a grown man. He deserves to know what's on the tape. However, for the people playing this game, probably not. It's one of those, I'll tell you when you're older type deals. <laughs> Here you go. Shufferin' shy guys! Did Goompa complain? Let's see, is it gonna be another coin? One coin! We're up to three now, we're so rich, guys. Alright, what do you want? Um, Koopa tea. With a fresh Koopa leaf. He basically tells us how to do it, so... We need to find ourselves a Koopa leaf, which is gonna be behind one of these bushes, maybe. Probably in the, did I? There we go. And then we need to go to Tasty for her to cook it up. Cook it up. 
good thing Tasty is right here. We don't have to go very far. Now I have to make sure, because by the, the when you're supposed to do these, these sort of favors get, there's a few that get unlocked after you beat every chapter. And so at this point in the game, um, Tasty is only able to cook with one ingredient. So I have to make sure that I don't want to use another ingredient or else I'm not going to make the Koopa tea. Her music's so happy. All right, Koopa tea restores seven FP. That's actually pretty good. The Koopa leaf, I think, restores three. So quite an upgrade. Okay. Here's your Koopa tea, you old man. Great growling gulpets. <laughs> uh, all right, a special gift. Ooh, what am I gonna get? What are you gonna give me? So we get not one, but three star pieces from Koopy Coot. And he does this a few other times, which is nice. I guess they um, ran out of places to put star pieces, so they're like, eh, one of his favorites, he's just gonna give us three. <laughs> All right. Um, he wants Luigi's autograph. They should call him Air Luigi. <laughs> like Air Jordan. Which, you know, the person, not the shoes. Oh, and Chuck Quizmo is back once again. By the time we finally do the whole star pieces and get to like finding Chuck Quizmo, I feel like we're not gonna need to find him very much, which is quite nice. Where does Merlovelyt, who tells fortunes about special things, live? That should be shooting star summit for some reason I was thinking of the one in dry dry outpost um but that's I thought her name was Merlovely but I guess it's not well while I'm thinking of that We'll go see Luigi. And I like Luigi, so we'll be reading his text. <laughs> Alright, Luigi. I need your autograph. What's that, Mario? You need something. He what? Mr. Koopa Koop wants to get my autograph. Me? He wants me to sign something? Whoa, cool, I'm flattered. I guess maybe I'm a little bit of a celebrity, huh? Wait one second, I'll write it right now. Why you gotta turn your back to me while you're writing it? Here you are, Mario, my autograph. Give my regards to Mr. Koopa Coot, okay? I mean, it kind of looks like it says Luigi. Well, goodbye, brother. I'll save Peach eventually. All right, back once again. Here's my brother's autograph. Hop and Hammer Brothers. Interesting. What are you gonna give me? Is it a coin again? One coin. Perfect. Alright, yes, we'll do you a favor. Um, you went shopping, dropped your wallet, oh boy. Talk to the guy who listened to the radio, uh, okay. Alright. So, should be in one of these bushes. In fact, it's that bush. Woohoo! The empty wallet. Did you spend all your money, Koopy Coot? Me think she did. I will thank Star Haven. 
<laughs> what have you given me this time? One coin. Eventually we're gonna get some more star pieces. Which is probably why people don't really do the favors, because it's like, all I'm getting is a coin. Really? Uh, a tasty tonic. That's gonna be... Toad Town. At the other shop. Okay, I'm actually gonna put in me buying the tasty tonic. Which... A sleepy sheep was worth more, so I'm kind of confused on the logic. Like, I get that the tasty tonic happens later because we don't go to this shop until later, but I would think that he would want something that would increase in price. Here you go, old Koopy Coot. Pouring piranhas! <laughs> uh, I'm interested to see how many more of these he's gonna make. Our one coin, as normal. Yes, yes. Alright, we're gonna do three more. Uh, beautiful fortune teller. I'm too shy to get her autograph. Alright, time to get Merlovely's autograph. At least while I'm here, I get to hear the nice shooting star summit music. Alright. Oh, whoops. Not close enough. Uh. No fortune telling today. Excuse me. You want my autograph? My, my. Mercy. Are you sure it's mine you want? You really do? Well, this is a first. What shall I do? Ah, of course. I don't mean to be a stick in the mud, but I'll give you the autograph on one condition. A small favor. I want you to visit my twin sister and fetch a crystal ball from her. She lives in a back alley in Dry Dry Outpost. Her name is Merle. Well, Mario, would you? So we gotta do a little bit more to get Mer Lovely's autograph. To Dry Dry Outpost we go. Are we going to see Chuck Quizmo again? Doesn't look like it. I'm always expecting him now. My older sister, Mer Lovely, what she want? Oh, I see. Is that so? I bet I know. Oh, ho, ho. Okay, okay. Please give this to Merlovely with love from her sis, Merly. The crystal ball. Awesome. I don't need any fortunes from you, I'm sorry to say. I am all good on that right now. Back we go. <laughs> I like how when you do the, like, super spin attack, you basically leave whatever partner you have behind in the dust. Ah, uh, my my. Hello there, Mario. Oh, good. Man, I'm just trying to give you your crystal ball, lady. I'm not trying to get a fortune from your pyramid. Oh, mercy. Thank you. I'll cherish this. And for you, here is my autograph, as promised. It'll be valuable someday. And that kind of looks like my Lovely as well. So, that's nice that they didn't just, like, scribble. Like, just kind of nothing. They actually somewhat tried to make it their signature. I am back with your second autograph, you old Koopa Coot. What are you going to say this time? Jump in jungle fuzzies! <laughs> oh my. We get a special gift, which means we are probably going to get three more star pieces. So we've gotten six super quickly. 
All right, two more. Two more favors. We'll be at 10. Uh, we'll be done with this video. This video is probably going to be longer. Um, like, uh, the last one. Probably not as long as the last one. Uh, okay. Since I've already read it, could I just talk to him? Oh. Man. I have to do- I always read the Toad Town news. I was hoping I could, like, get away with it. Maybe it's because it'll say something different. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Um, but yeah, hopefully- I hope this video is not going to be as long as the last one. And yeah, it still says the same thing. And then the gossip should be the same as well. Yep. Not- not any good gossip this time. I should have really gave it to Koopy Coot whenever it was the whole XXO heart heart thing. I'm sure he would have loved that. Okay, well now that I've read the news a second time... Those wild tales... Now I'm hip! <laughs> and what do we get for helping you out? But another coin. Alright, our last one that we're gonna do for him. Uh, he wants a life shroom. Which, can I give him the one I already have? Yes, I can. Okay. I've got a couple in the bank, so this is fine. Buy the musty shroom. <laughs> Alright. We get... Another one coin. Oh. He's asking about if we've gone to the playroom, which we have not because we've just been doing favor after favor for you. Uh, but instead of a silver credit, now we're gonna have a gold credit. Ooh, I guess that would be the way. Instead of like farming, like grinding bad guys. I guess this is the way that you're supposed to make money if you need it. So we'll definitely have to check out the playroom now. All right, but that's gonna be it. Oh, that's not going to be it. It's gonna be it after we do one final quiz from Chuck Quizmo. What's the question you got for me, my good wormy sir? What is the name of the character who joined you at the Koopa Bros Fortress? That would be my favorite character. And the one... Okay, I'm like, where is even this question at in my list? Um, the one that I have out right now, and my favorite, Bombette. Hooray! Alright, get our star piece. We have answered 16 questions so far. Awesome. All right, so um, we'll finish Koopy Coot's favors in the next video and get our final few badges, or we'll see if we can. I know there's one that we can get that doesn't require star pieces, so we'll get that one for sure. And then we might be doing ourselves a Chuck Quizmo type run. As always though, be sure to like, comment, share, and even subscribe if you have not already done so. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!